How's it going everybody? Welcome back. And today we're going to be talking about what a VPN is and basically just a quick tutorial on how to use a VPN. Now I've tested over a couple of dozen VPNs. I've narrowed it down to these three as the best overall. They all vary in budgets and features. So pick and choose depending on your own situation and what you're looking for out of these VPNs and your own preferences and budget, of course. But let's get straight down to it. Okay, so a VPN creates a secure connection between the user's device and the private network by encrypting the data that is sent over the connection. This means that even if someone were to intercept the data, they would not be able to read it or use it without the encryption key. VPNs also use tunneling protocols to create a virtual tunnel between the user's device and the private network. This tunnel encrypts and protects all data that is sent over the connection, including sensitive information such as passwords and financial data. In addition to providing security and privacy, VPNs can also be used to access content or services that are restricted to a specific geographic region. For example, if a user is traveling abroad and wants to access a streaming service that is only available in their home country, they can use a VPN to connect to a server in that country and access the service as if they were still at home. Overall, VPNs are a valuable tool for individuals and businesses that want to protect their online privacy and security and to access content and services that may be restricted in their current location. And using a VPN can be as simple as just clicking the link in the description down below, depending on which one you choose and just go ahead and purchase your subscription. You'll be sent an email, click on that download link, and you'll be able to have one of these right here. And simply let's just go with express VPN. For example, let's say I want to unblock us Netflix because I'm not in the States, go to the United States, connect to Chicago, for example, turn it on. And it is as simple as that. Now, when I go to my IP finder, I'll just go ahead and show you guys, it will say that that I am located in Chicago simply because I'm connected to ExpressVPN's Chicago server. Now, if you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find these suppressing discounts in the description down below, as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn more about the privacy policy, speed streaming, and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. Besides that, keep in mind they're all covered by a 30 day money back guarantee, so you can test drive these VPNs for 30 days risk free. Otherwise, you can simply get yourself the refund if you're not satisfied for whatever reason. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.